Purity is water from sinks, showers, baths, and washing machines, never from the toilet. Not clean enough to drink, it's a great source of irrigation water. In combination with water-wise landscaping, rainwater harvesting, and conservation, reusing gray water can help protect watersheds and conserve water for other living things. Instead of sending gray water down the drain to mix with sewage, we can redirect it to the landscape, keeping it separate. It can offset the need for irrigation with potable water. Most homes reduce water use by 10 to 40 percent with the gray water system. It also makes the plants happy. They thrive with frequent, plentiful irrigation. Gray water can be used in most any climate, although in places with seasonal freezing, flooding, or high ground water tables may not use it all year long. I love having a gray water system. It's so satisfying to do laundry and know that water is also irrigating my fruit trees. It saves time, saves water, and reduces the amount of wastewater going to the sewer system. In a house, a gray water system can be very low cost and simple to install. For example, systems like the laundry to landscape or a gravity flow system. These systems take one or two days to install and cost a few hundred dollars in materials. Professionally installed, the costs range from 700 to a couple thousand dollars. To keep plants happy, it's important to use plant-friendly products. Some ingredients like salt and guan are harmful to plants. The legality of gray water really depends on where you live. Many states allow for gray water reuse. Some require permits, others don't. Some places even promote it, like San Francisco, California, or Tucson, Arizona, offering incentives and free education. Check out these resources for more information on gray water systems.